people are going crazy over the electronic electromagnetic fields videos that I've done between the EV and the gas car. And they, they keep saying that I'm lying because the uh, I'm showing that the EVs actually have less uh, of these uh, radiation. It's not like ionic radi uh, It's not like ionizing radiation, right? It's just radiation coming from the uh, these fields in the vehicles. But when I put it in a gas car, it's like, dude, the gas cars have more to some degree while they're driving than the electric cars. So, so yeah, I'm going to put it in the floorboard to show you, um, since that's a special request to put the, uh, the the meter in the floorboard, and I'll drive. I'll just start up the vehicle, and we'll see what happens. So this is in the gas car, and right next to my leg here on the driver's side, I got the meter. I'm going to start it up. So this is a 2024 Mazda Miata. So let me go ahead and turn the climate control off. So there's no climate control. Uh, there's no hybrid system. Nothing like that. Let me go ahead and rev the engine. All right, turn the engine off. All right, everything's off. Go ahead and start it back up. So yeah, this is about as non-electric vehicle as you can get. So there's no hybrid, there's, no, there's just a gas engine, manual transmission, even the climate control is off right now. I'm going to turn the climate control on. Off. Yeah, it seems like the climate control doesn't really do much as far as the readings here. It's mostly the engine. So yeah, that's where we're at. They're on the floorboard there. <laughs> 